two Sundays ago, it was Owo Massacre. We all cried. Last Sunday, it was Kaduna. Not much outcry. We've adapted to regular massacres in southern Kaduna. Who is in charge of Nigeria? It seems governance has been abandoned for politicking. If not for the families of victims, we will not even have had a manifest for the Owo Massacre. Victims are mere statistics here. I mean, they're still victims of Chibok, Dapchi, and Kaduna Abuja train abductions with their captors. And the Nigerian government goes on its usual business. We have to hurry to borrow money to pay salaries. If there's any good news about Nigeria, do we join the government and pretend that the country is not under attack by terrorists? Do we celebrate fishing festivals while human lives are being fished from fighter jets? No one has even bothered to explain how that plane got in the air. Should I go about my merry business of buying fuel to power electricity and pretend we don't have terrorists in our forests down south here, armed to their teeth? Do I focus on vote buy during the Kitty elections or congratulate our impoverished elders for selling their patrimony for a morsel of bread for another four years? Oh, my Nigeria, who bewitched you? Well, let's be positive. My advocacy today, therefore, is to ask you to be the structure for a new Nigeria. If you're tired of what Nigeria has become, then you must be the change. Get your PVC. Don't sell it. Educate the next person to you about the importance of voting in the right person, structure or no structure, who can build infrastructure that will give us constant electricity to create our own wealth. The Yorubas have been greeting themselves, Eku Ilu, why you, before I was born. Eku Nigeria, my people. We continue to suffer and smile. Our only hope to change things is to take back Nigeria from the old stock. Things won't be perfect immediately, but there are a few politicians who have the legacy of saving money, funding education, and spending government money for the people and not themselves. Who is in charge of Nigeria? It's you and I. Let's get our PVCs to put the right persons in government, build a new structure based on merit and not ethnicity nor religion, and live a better Nigeria for our grandchildren. We will succeed in 2022. Thank you.